It's that time. I have an NGD for myself today. I'm excited. I'm actually going to put my glasses on because I have some paperwork here to read to you guys. So good morning. What the hell is going on? It's an early one. It's a Friday. I'm normally not here. I'm here just for you guys. I'm here to show off my brand new guitar. The guitar on my left. This is my newest finish. I did three brand new finishes. This one is called Solana. And the idea behind Solana was to, or these new finishes in general, was to be able to give you guys crazy looking, badass finishes at a super affordable price. Look at that beautiful A2. You guys notice anything different about this A2? It's a bevel delete. This does not exist. This is something I wanted to build for myself, the bevel delete, and it came out so good, we decided to do a limited run. That's right. So we're kicking off this limited run. We're gonna talk about that right now. Look at the edges. Brandon, can you zoom in on that? Yep. So we're gonna talk about this limited run. It does not start until tomorrow at 10 a.m. That's when the orders actually open. And just like any run we've ever done, there are three stages. So this is stage one. It's gonna be the most affordable. And then there's a stage two and a stage three, which I did not, I elected not to build examples of the stage two or stage three. You might be like, why not? Well, the reason why is anytime we've done these runs and we've built up a bunch of examples, you guys use the builder anyway. You can see what it's gonna look like or get a general idea of what it's gonna look like. And what'll happen with these examples is I don't sell them right away because I don't think it's fair for someone to be able to pay that low price of a run and get one initially, get one right away. I don't think it's fair for everybody else that has to wait. So then I sit on them for a while and then eventually I put them up for sale. And sometimes, you know, it's, it's harder to sell because it might not be exactly what you want. We already sold a bunch in the run and then they end up finally selling, right? So I decided to just build these examples here and that's it. I don't have any more in the works. I don't have any stage twos or stage threes. But the great news is, is online, you'll be able to build a one, a two, or a three. We're gonna launch the builder for you guys at 10 a.m. today. Um, and then you guys will be able to play around with it. You'll have a full 24 hours. Now what's different about this run, and what a run is, for those of you guys that don't know, it's a limited set of options that I pick and put together on one model. You can get you know, different string configurations, guitar, bass, right-handed, left-handed, things like that. Um, so you're not stuck there. It's not every single option we offer, of course. That's what makes it a limited run. And what it does for us is it makes us more efficient. Well, when we're more efficient, what can we do? We can pass that savings on to you guys. So this is my run, um, and I've never done this before. This is a model that doesn't exist. It's an A2 which exists, but it's a bevel delete, which the only way to get a bevel delete is within this run. Um, this is not something we're adding to the builder. I have no intentions of adding the bevel delete A2 um, to our lineup. And the reason for that is there are so many CNC codes that need to get created just by removing the bevel. So what we'll be able to do this time is we'll be able to program the CNC codes as they sell. So We'll get all the sales together. I'll, I'll make a list for my programmer and he'll have to make all these specific programs. And we're not opening it up for every single possible thing. Um, and that's what makes us, or gives us the ability to do this and at an affordable price. So this is Solana and this is Imperial. Check this out. Just love the way these look. And these have a you know very two-tone like finish. Um, this has uh, a lot of um, lavender going on in it. 
It's like a lavender, if I had to describe it, I'd say like a lavender gray, pinkish look in person. Um, all of these in the stage one are gonna have roasted fingerboards and roasted necks. They're gonna have truss rod cover deletes. They're gonna be swamp ash bodies. They'll be two piece bodies. These are both one piece upgraded, which you guys will be able to do. Um, they have no truss rod covers on them. Uh, all, the whole run has truss rod cover delete, uh, but we tried to load up really great options. Um, you might be wondering what the price is. So price point for a stage one, not with these particular finishes. These are upgraded finishes because they are time consuming. Um, it's $16.49 gets you into the stage one. And that's going to be a either an antique ash uh, with a raw tone or a various uh, solid colors that we have. I think there's like eight solid colors in there. Um, you guys will be able to obviously use the builder and mess around with that. Um, this is... Hard to see because I looked on the camera. Maybe I can get like, you tell me what angle you can kind of see it, Brandon. Maybe pull it back a little towards you. Okay. Oh, that's better. So this is Malibu. Uh, this is a very unique, very cool looking color. Um, I did just this sample board. Uh, you could see parts are taped off because I did nine colors total. And I picked my favorite three out of them for this run. So I had three boards this size and three colors on each board, and I picked my three top favorites to release for this run. Um, there's a lot of options, again, in the stage one. Um, you can see even, you know, delete the volume or delete the tone and move the volume to the tone position. Uh, this is an uh, Empyrean neck and Thorium bridge pickup in my personal guitar. This is actually my guitar. Uh, you can do matching headstocks. You don't have to, like this is standard. So if you're really price conscious and you need to be at that 1649, you can still get an amazing guitar from us. Um, but you know, you're gonna wanna cut some of the things out. So the great thing is, is you're getting the roasted maple neck standard. You're getting the roasted fingerboard standard. You're getting truss rod cover delete standard. Um, you're getting all these really cool things at a very affordable price. You know, American made custom shop um, and these are going to be like a semi custom, you know, they're still full custom. Don't get me wrong, but there's a limited menu, right? Um, and we are doing for the run, we're doing, uh, either, you know, a Kiesel trim, the regular hip shot fixed. We're doing the multi-scale, of course, uh, we're doing the, um, uh, what the Evertune. And then Brandon, I guess we never did talk about this. We probably should add the multi-scale trim option to it. Is a multi-scale trim? It is. It I is on there. Okay, cool. cool. Yep. Um, we are not doing Floyd Rose on a six. So all you guys that are bummed out, I'm really sorry. Um, I have to do what's the number one selling things for me. Um, doing them in six, seven, and eight string, both right-handed and left. Bases you can get four, five, and six string uh, bases. And this is gonna be a stage one. So a lot going on. And I'm just gonna briefly go over the stage one. So again, you have an ash body. These are, these are how they're gonna come standard. So we'll go over that first. So 1649 gets you um, a six string with a hip shot bridge with an ash body, roasted maple neck, roasted maple fingerboard. They're all gonna have a raw tone um, body and a raw tone head plate that's gonna have no finish on it. So it's gonna look like this one here. So it'll have that roasted look throughout. Um, we're gonna have offset staggered rings, stainless steel, medium jumbo frets, chrome hardware, either a black or a white logo. Um, you're gonna have black pickups and then the free choices. So here's your colors you get to pick from at no charge. You can go black, which always is amazing. White, white, that's a very pure white. Kiesel Racing Green, Blood Red, Tropic, love Tropic, by the way, um, Sky Blue, White Pink, Primer Gray, and then we did add Purple, and we added the um, Olive Drab Green to this. Uh, those are your free choices, along with you can get Antique Ash. So that's no charge. Um, you can delete the inlays if you don't want inlays on there. You can swap to a Royal Ebony fingerboard. Uh, let's see here. You can go with a 270 um, 
scale length, so the longer scale length. So I guess on a six, it would be 265. The seven would be 270. Um, eight strings are already 270 standard. On a bass, you can go to the 370 multi-scale. That's 37 inch. And 270 means 27 inch for guitar. You can get the Empyrean neck, the Thorium bridge, the Beryllium neck, or the Beryllium bridge. Standard is going to be lithium. Uh, headstocks, that's what's pretty cool about this one because the only way to get this shape is within this run. I've opened up headstocks. Normally, it's, it's very strict. So you can get our GT headstock, the reverse version of the GT, the more aggressive inline. This is a reverse version. You can get the regular or the reverse. Um, and then you can get our more of our aggressive one, but it's you know a four plus three or a three plus four, depending on which side you're looking at. You can't get a pointed angled because we don't offer that with roasted, right? Um, something else you can get here is white inlays or black inlays. You can get uh, for pickups, you can get the Kiesel Racing Green, of course, black, and then you can get white. Uh, pickup pole pieces are a pay choice. Let's see here. And that's those are ten dollars. Black hardware, that's 20 bucks. Stainless jumbo frets, 20 bucks. You can delete the tone and move the volume to the tone location. That's uh, gonna be 50. You can get a thinner neck profile, right? And we don't normally do thinner neck profiles on roasted necks, but you can do that. That's 40 bucks. Uh, if you wanna change to a three piece neck, you can go three piece maple walnut for 50. If you want a black um, rich light fingerboard, that's 50 bucks. You can upgrade the body to a one piece like you see here, $50. Uh, Multi-scale is a $100 upgrade. Uh, Kiesel trim, 50 bucks. Evertune, $250. Matching headstock, 40 bucks. The Magma Metallic, that was a new color we added uh, beginning of the year, that's $50. We have our um, color shift, the very popular um, green to purple, that's 250. Normally a $600 option. And then these are the brand new colors, right? So for Solana, this is gonna be a $150 upgrade. Um, Malibu is also 150. These are both very complex colors to do. This looks very complex. It's not nearly as complex. Um, so we're only charging 50 for this. These two are again, very hard, very labor intensive. This one is just looks amazing and it's pretty easy for us to do. So rather than us just making that extra money and keeping them all at 150. I'm just going to hook you guys up and charge 50 for that one. Uh, this is uh, Imperial. Uh, let's see what else. I think I got everything within the um, stage one. So that's a stage one. Um, we're going to do a little bit of questions right after uh, I finish kind of wrapping here. All right. So there's that stage two, which you don't have an example of. This is how they're going to come. They're going to be a poplar burl top only. Um, matching headstock, you're going to have a ash body with an antique ash treatment. It's going to have a rear natural clear, meaning the side and back are not going to have any paint on it. You're going to have a deep binding effect. So you're going to have the deep binding effect running down the side instead of the beveled area. Um, it's going to be a raw tone finish. Uh, Cali burst is going to be standard. You're going to have a, um, let's see, uh, roasted maple neck, just like the stage one, roasted maple fingerboard, the same uh, ring, staggered offset ring inlays. Uh, it'll be chrome hardware standard, drop shadow logo silver, black pickups, truss rod cover delete. So here's where you get some options. So free choices. You can get a reverse Cali, fades by Casey. So really cool, you know, multicolor fades that Casey does. Um, you can get the inlays that are the um, the K logo with the offset staggered dots, stainless jumbo frets, black chrome hardware, black pole pieces. Uh, you can change the logo to a drop shadow silver, uh, drop shadow black over silver, I guess is what it is. Um, thinner neck profile. You get the longer scale links, either the two, uh, 26 and a half on a six, 27 on a seven, 
um, or the three uh, 37 inch on the base. Uh, pickups are free to upgrade the Empyrean neck, Thorium bridge, Beryliums, and um, you get the same headstock options as you would get on the stage one. Uh, let's see here. So pay choices, still the trim, multi-scale, um, those are still the same. Um, you get a chambered body option for $100. You can get a chambered body. I prefer chambered bodies personally. You can add a three-piece layer, which will separate the top from the body for $100. Uh, let's see here. Um, you can upgrade to a five-piece poplar burl or five-piece, 5A poplar burl top for $150. You can upgrade the body to a one-piece ash um, for $50. You can get the Rich Light Diamond Black Fingerboard for 50, Pale Moon Ebony Fingerboard for 250, which is really cool to be able to get one of those. Uh, roasted Flame Maple Fingerboard, $100. Uh, you get, um, uh, what is it? Uh, abalone Ring Inlays for 40. You can add a Roasted Flame Neck. Now this is a 7A Master Grade Roasted Flame Neck. So this is gonna be what I'm gonna to use to talk about the stage threes. Uh, but you can get a roasted 4A flame maple neck uh, for $450, which is the first time we've ever offered that within a stage two run. Um, you can get a three piece walnut purple heart neck for $50. Of course, delete the tone and move the volume to the tone position for 50. You can add um, a TBST, so a trans black burst around the perimeter. Uh, for 100. So that is your stage two. So a lot going on with stage two. So, you know, just to recap, it's going to be a, a poplar burl top. You can upgrade to a 5A if you want. And then um, you're going to get Cali or reverse Cali or a fade of some sort by Casey. So that's really cool options. They're going to have all the neat things where you're going to have the beveled, uh, not beveled, but the, oh, it'll look a lot like this. Right? So you have the antique ash on the back. You look at it from the side, you're going to have the deeped binding here. And then, of course, you would have no bevels here. And you could do a reverse cali like this or do a standard cali or a fade. So some pretty cool uh, features on that. Now, this is something we haven't done before. The stage threes, you can order those online and actually will be required to order those online unless you get a Jeff to do finish. That will be the only time you can call in and talk to a salesperson to place this order is if you're getting a Jeff to do finish on a stage three. So I'm gonna go over what the stage three includes and then we'll go back over this and answer some questions. Okay, so stage three, we're gonna call this a Kiesel edition light. So it's not a Kiesel edition at all in any way, shape or form, but it would be a kind of like a light version of that. A lot of you have been wanting to get a Kiesel edition from me. I don't have you know, enough time to be able to keep up with the demand. So this is your opportunity to get something that is close, but not a Kiesel edition, but it's not a Kiesel edition price point either. Price point's gonna come in at $54.99, which most Kiesel editions are gonna be $8,000 to $14,000, right? So a lot more affordable than a KE. You're gonna get a 7A Poplar Burl top and back. So you're going to have the top and the back 7A master grade poplar burl. These are going to come in a raw tone finish. And then you are going to get a roasted one piece swamp ash body. That's going to be no finish on it. It's going to have a rear natural clear on it. So in other words, whoa, I'll so knock it over. You'll have the poplar burl on the back. And then this whole area is going to have no finish on it. The side will have no finish on it, giving you a really cool look. Um, I'm excited to see how these are going to come out. Now, what's different and makes these different than a Kiesel Edition is a Kiesel Edition would normally have be a 7A top and a 7A back. You'll have a layer between the top and the body, the back and the body, making it a five-piece body. We're not offering that on this. So... You're going to have a three-piece body in the sense that it's going to be a 7A top, the body, then a 7A back to it. So it's going to differentiate itself from a Kiesel edition. The head plate 
will not have any poplar burl on it. It's going to be a 7A roasted flame maple neck, no headstock wood overlay, matching fingerboard. So you'll have that same uh, flame maple um, roasted 7A look on the fingerboard. So it'll be cohesive all the way throughout. And then um, you can get abalone inlays in any shape we offer those, not just any of the shapes in abalone, but whatever inlays we normally offer in abalone, you can get those. Uh, let's see here. Um, Drop Shadow Logo Silver. These are going to be Cali Burst Standard. Um, you're going to get 7A Roasted Flame Maple Back Plates. So your trim cover, and or if you have a trim, and then the back plate. The only exception would be if you got an Evertune. We're not making Evertune back plates out of Roasted Flame Maple. They are massive. I don't have it wide enough, so you would not get an Evertune plate. That would be the only exception. So if you did get an Evertune, uh, you would be subject to their plastic back plate that they offer. Uh, let's see, black chrome hardware is going to be standard. Options at no charge. You can get a black limbo body. You can chamber the body. You can go to a drop shadow logo gold. You can get a reverse Cali. And you can also add Casey's fades. And you can get clear gloss. This is the only, the stage three is going to be the only one we're doing gloss finishes in. Stage one and two are raw tone only. Okay, pay options. This is something I added that Brandon and Jeremy will need to take note. I added EVO frets. So you can get EVO or EVO jumbos for $200. You can do a trans black burst that would be front and rear for $200. You can add gold hardware for $100. And then if you want Jeff to do finishes, here's your options. You can get a monster burst, a reverse monster burst, a candy finish or a fire finish. Those are at $400. Keep in mind, I'm doing the top, the body, and the back in those finishes. So it's going to wrap around the whole thing. It's gonna, they're gonna look amazing. Because we don't have that five piece body with the, the extra lines, I'm wrapping the finish around the whole entire thing and giving you guys a hell of a deal because normally the finishes that I do are gonna be 400 just for the top. So now you're getting the top and the back at the same price, right? So monster burst, reverse monster burst, any color candy we offer or a fire finish. Now the only way to order a stage three over the phone, so don't call your sales guy. The only way to order one over the phone be, uh, via email or over the phone is if you get a monster, reverse monster, candy or fire, it's the only way. Other than that, you're gonna use the online builder over the weekend, you're gonna place your order for a one, a two or a three. That's it. So that's a wrap on um, what we're doing. Now I think it's a good time to open it up for some questions. <coughs> Bless you. Thank you. What do you guys think about this run? Are you guys excited? I'm excited. I mean, I love the way the bevel delete Aries looks, the A2. From the comments, people seem excited and it seems like a lot of these guys are gonna get in on the run. Cool. And that run, just to recap, opens up tomorrow at 10 a.m. There are limited spots within each stage. Now, we're gonna limit you guys to a total of two of each stage. That's the max. And you can get one of every stage, basically. So if you wanted, you could order a one, a two, and a three, if you wanted, or two ones, two twos, two threes. That's what you can do. Here's a good question that I think uh, might've gotten missed. They're asking what pickup configuration options are available for bases. Oh yeah, that's a great one. Um, it did get missed. So for bases, you're going to be standard with the, um, the routes for our radius pickups, or you can get the KT3. So you can get the three um, pickups, uh, which are our new tritiums. Those are your two options. So the standard radius two humbuckers or two singles will be no charge. And then when you go to the um, KT3, it's gonna be a $300 charge total because we automatically put the dark glass preamp in it. That's a great question. Sorry, I missed that. Uh, another good question. Uh, are these new finish options exclusive to the run? 
Haven't decided that yet, to be completely honest. Uh, I'm just focused on the run right now. Um, this was something that uh, we decided to do based on how good everything came out. I was building this for myself. Um, today's actually my birthday, and so I wanted to, you know, have have a new guitar um, today. And so I decided I was like, well, we can we can do this uh, little live launch today for our uh, our limited run. So uh, pretty cool because it's the first time we've ever done a run that is this limited, right? If you love the way this looks, is the only way to get one. Uh, are these new Bevel Delete A2s available as neck throughs? They are not. Nope. That's a whole nother set of programs. I'm just doing the bolt on and I'm just doing this run. That's it. Are these new finish options translucent colors or stains? Uh, these are stain based. Yeah, these are ones that I came up with and created and I love the way they look. They have so much dimension and depth. Um, and, you know, kind of over the Christmas break when I was here working, I had an idea to try to come up with a couple new finishes that are what I would say very vibrant, a lot of life in them and very affordable. You know, um, I mean, I get, you know, obviously you're, you know, the upgrade is 150 on this. But to get something that's that vibrant, normally you're paying for a flame top and then paying for a finish. And so trying to create new colors that go over swamp ash that just look amazing, it's, it's, um, it's definitely difficult, you know, uh, and trying to be unique too at the same time, right? I just love how that looks. Show this off a little bit more while you're asking questions. Is there gonna be a place that I can see all of the options and pricing for these guitars? Yeah, we're going to have a specific um, link for the actual, what we call run builder. And it's a special builder you will use to build one of these guitars. And the cool thing is it's going to be live at 10 today, 10 a.m. And then we're going live tomorrow. Well, not going live. We're releasing the ability to order them tomorrow at 10 a.m. So you have a full 24 hours to mess around with it. And there's no reason to call a sales guy. All the information's there. Um, the configurations are there. If you do run into issues at all where maybe you're trying to add something that's there, unless something pops up and says, this option can't be combined with this, unless something like that pops up, if you're having trouble, you can always email um, into webmaster at kieselguitars.com. Now, I'm not saying if you don't see an option you want, don't email. I'm saying if you're having trouble with something, then you can email in. Um, but everything should be pretty self-explanatory on there. Um, this is not our first rodeo for runs, uh, especially within the website. So um, hopefully everything is uh, goes off without a hitch on that. And they are limited within each stage, right? So stage one being the most available, stage two less, and stage three, of course, even less, because I only have so many of these 7A flame maple neck blanks, right? I got to make back plates and all that. So it'll be pretty neat, um, you know, for you guys to be able to get into a guitar, um, especially like the stage three, where you have a top and a back, you can't get a matching back on a guitar unless you get a Kiesel edition, which again is going to be the 8K and up range and take close to two years. If I wanted to order a Jeff to do finish, do I have to wait until Monday to order? You would, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, you would have to wait um, on the stage three because we're not releasing them yet. Um, that'll give you time to, you know, get all your specs together um, and use the builder. So how you would do that is you would pre-use the builder, build everything up you want, and then you would work with the sales guy on Monday morning, sending them over your stage three, and then either on the phone um, or email. Uh, figuring out what changes you want to make. Uh, but they none of them are getting matching head plates because I want to really make sure we are careful on keeping these separate from a Kiesel edition. So I, I'm not going to do matching head plates. If that means you're not going to buy, then you're going to have to buy a stage two instead of a three if you want a matching head plate. Um, and uh, I'm not doing five-piece bodies, so just three-piece bodies. You're still going to get all the aesthetics you want and the bitchin' looks that you want. It, they're going to be really neat looking. I'm stoked to see them. 
Here's a pretty good question. Uh, since these are beveled delete guitars, are the stages with tops going to have a bent top? Yeah, they will. Yeah, this these all have. Uh, maybe I kind of missed that. You could see that curve there. Our normal, like what we would put on our DC, a normal comfort, our our regular Aries that has a bevel delete. You're going to have that same contoured top. Very comfortable. Um, you're still going to have amazing access. I mean, you can see my hand. You know, it's like I can literally get to the pickup. Um, you can see right where I'm at right here. And that that carve or that cut goes right to the 24th fret. So plenty of access even without the bevel. Um, same neck heel. Same everything that you know and love about an A2 if you already have one. You know, same super thin profile on that neck contour carve. Are Fishman pickups an option for this run? They actually are. Yeah. That was one thing that was not on my sheet that I did miss. You can get Fishman pickups. First time we've ever done that is the Fishman pickups. Is Piezo an option for the run? Piezo is not an option for the run. What is going to be the estimated build time on these run guitars? So stage ones are going to wrap up the quickest at 8 to 12 weeks. Um, you have stage twos at 10 to 14. And then stage threes are obviously going to be more time. It's hard for me to give an estimate on stage threes because I don't know how many are going to get Jeff to do finishes. So I'm just going to say around 20 weeks. It could be sooner. Um, stage threes do require a 50% deposit because... We're putting 7A tops on them, um, so that would be the only difference uh, on, on that. These are also all non-returnable, so once you place your order, because it is a run, and we're building so many instruments that are very similar in spec, uh, the last thing we would ever want is, let's say, 10% of you wanted to return them, then I have all these guitars that are similar spec in, in stock, and so we don't offer any returns on um, or cancellations on run purchases. That's been our policy since our very first run 10 years ago. 2014 was our first run. Yeah, that sold out. We did this first run. It was a 27-inch scale, seven string, a DC-7X. And uh, we did that and sold out in seven hours, 50 of them. It's pretty crazy. How long do I have to be able to order one of these? Uh, you have until they sell out. I, I don't know. I mean, I've seen runs sell out in as quick as seven, eight hours, and I've seen them take as long as two, three days. I've never seen them take more than three days, if that gives you any indication. Now, I will say this. Stage three customers, those of you that want to call in, um, I'm not going to say that I'm going to have unlimited spots because I don't, but I will make sure I have some spots for you guys Monday to call in to get a Jeff to do finish version. I mean, we, maybe everybody wants a Jeff to do stage three and we don't sell any over the weekend. I don't know. It all really depends. You guys might like um, the regular fades or the, um, you know, the standard finishes, which are amazing. You might want that over what I'm doing, which is totally fine. We got Sean Moore in here. He said, sorry, I had to walk away for a second, but is Tritium pickups an option for a stage one bass? They are, yeah. Tritium would be an option for any stage um, on the bases, yes. So you can get KT3, that's the code for that, that automatically gets you dark glass preamp. That's a $300 total price with the pickup upgrade and the um, preamp. What's up, Sean Moore? I know you love those pickups. This thing sounds sick. And I did not build a base as an example. These are the only two examples I built. You know, years past, I mean, I would build so much stuff and have all of these to show off. And it's cool initially, but ultimately you're going to get on there and you're going to use the configurator and configure exactly what you want. And it's going to be different than exactly what I spec out. And then those sit in my in-stock section for a little while. And I, I don't want that. Are either of those guitars for sale? No. They're not. Um, this one is mine. And like I was uh, saying, when I first started this up, you might have missed it. Um, I don't think it's right or fair for me to sell an example to someone 
uh, right away and make everybody else wait for the exact same thing. So uh, this is not available, and this one is mine. Is a drop tuner an option for the bases? Um, I don't see why not. I mean, we could add the hip shot detuner. Hold on, let me make a note. That's an easy. That's an easy thing to add. Is there any way for me to pay for a gloss finish on stage one or two? Absolutely not. Nope. Sorry. Yeah, the whole point of my pricing and doing this is the the efficiency here at the shop. And the moment we're glossing something, our efficiency goes way down. And uh, I'm not offering gloss finishes. Even last time when I did the stage twos, I sold about 35 stage twos. Three of them got gloss. It told me that I don't need to offer gloss. So that's why we're not offering gloss anymore on a stage two. Plus, it's a poplar top. They look amazing. And same with these finishes. These look amazing with a raw tone. That's my personal opinion, um, of course. But What is the starting price on stage two? Stage two, I did not go there, did I? Um, stage two is, I think, $23.99? Yes, $23.99 for stage two. $2,400 gets you into a stage two with some amazing features. Um, pretty, uh, pretty crazy. And for those of you not familiar with our guitars, these are custom American-made guitars at, you know, modern import guitar prices. Crazy. It's true. Uh, is there any pickup configuration options available? There are not. Just on the bass, you can get the, uh, the KT3, and then on guitar, you can get Fishman active pickups. That would be it. I didn't sell very many um, in the... Uh, in the pickup configuration department, like we didn't do that many different configurations. And because this is a unique shape, uh, meaning bevel delete, it's a whole nother set of programs, each configuration for these with and without a top. So for us to do pickup configurations within that, it's just gonna snowball and get out of control. And I'm trying to do something and give you guys a really cool, unique, um, you know, purchase at a, a crazy price. I'm going to lay this down so you guys can see the uh, bodies probably better. Is there something specific about Swamp Ash and Raw Tone that you like? Yes. So Swamp Ash is a very lightweight wood. It has a great overall sound. Um, it's very percussive. It has good volume to it. And it's very affordable for a lot of good looks. Swamp Ash is expensive for us, but when you go to buy it, you're only paying for just the body upgrade, right? So to get a cool look like these guitars or even a solid black one, um, you're not gonna get that without it being Swamp Ash. So when you have the ability to buy something at an affordable price, um, American Custom Shop affordable price, uh, it's, it's probably the best choice all around. Um, if I was going to build a guitar for myself, well, I did, um, I would do, and I wasn't going to put a top on it. I'm going with a swamp ash body. If there is no top, I want something that looks cool. This is what I'm doing for myself. So I wanted to pass that on to you guys. And that's why we do them. Swamp ash is inexpensive. It's a rare wood. We have to work very hard to keep it in stock. Um, we did, we were able to line up. Um, wider one piece. We have enough here. Um, that's not always the case. Normally, I don't offer you guys the ability to upgrade to a one piece. I'm offering the ability to get a one piece. What's the pricing for basses? Basses are going to be the same guitar price, but they're going to have a modifier of $150 for a four string, and then it would go up from there. Can you do the same run, but with a headstock delete option? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there you go. Uh, can I get an A2 without the jack on the back? Uh, not in this run, no. Yeah, this run is like, we're not taking special requests. That's the whole point of a run. If you wanted an A2, like a custom order, and you didn't want the jack on the back, 
We'd have a special programming fee. You'd have to prepay the instrument and be no returns. But yeah, we could do that for you. Do the upper fr do you have less upper fret access with the bevel delete? No, you really don't. I mean, you can't play your pickup as easily. But if you look here, uh, how you tell if an instrument has good access or not, just take a line and put it across the 24th fret. You guys see that okay? See where the cut is on the, the lower horn? You've got plenty of room to get way down in there. Uh, what's the name of those two new finishes? This one is Solana and this one is Imperial. Uh, this one is Malibu. It's really hard to see on camera, Malibu. It's a, a deep, you know, blue. Uh, these are named after our beaches here in the area. Obviously, you have Solana Beach, Imperial Beach, and Malibu Beach, you know, all SoCal beaches. Um, I think we're all, we're through all the questions. Sweet. Uh, well, everybody, uh, hopefully, uh, you know, watching this over, if you miss something or you're logging in late and you're like, what's this, what's that? Rewatch the video. Hopefully that answers everything. We will have a dedicated builder up for you guys at 10. It is 946. Um, and so we'll have one uh, up for you guys at 10, 10 a.m. today. And we don't go live with the orders until 10 a.m. tomorrow. Um, and just to recap, stage one and stage two, you cannot order those over the phone. You have to use the builder. Uh, stage three, the only way to order one over the phone with one of our sales guys is if you get a Jeff to do finish. The only Jeff to do finishes we're offering are Monster Burst, Reverse Monster Burst, Fire, and any of the candy finishes that I offer. Um, those are going to be the ones that you can get over the phone with the guys. Uh, you would call in 858 Guitars or email. Uh, the Jeff to do finishes are gonna add $400. If you wanted to do like a, like a candy but have a burst, there would be an extra charge on top of that, of course. We'll take them case by case, but I'm not doing um, denims, um, earth, you know, the other finishes that I've offered, no arctics. Um, we're just going to stay within the monster burst, reverse monster burst candies and the fire finish. I'm really excited to see a fire finish, um, done, uh, because the way I'm going to be doing them is I'm going to be wrapping the finish on the body where the swamp ash is on the monsters, candies and fire. And I think they're going to look so amazing. I'm so excited to see them. I've actually never done it that way with a top and a back before. So um, you would have something that we don't ever offer, right? So stage three, it's the only way you can get a back on a guitar without it being a Kiesel edition. And then this is the only way to get a bevel delete. Aries is within this run, starting at 1649. On that note, um, thanks for hanging out, guys. Thanks for watching. Share this with some friends. If uh, you know, someone that's been wanting a Kiesel, wanting something cool, wanting something unique. Maybe it's a guitar collector uh, or someone looking for a, a, you know, get into one of our guitars for the first time or like a John Gamrat adding his thousandth Kiesel. Um, on that note, I'm out. Thank you guys. We'll see you later.